It's 48 past two. Whee! It's getting cold. Yep. It's a colder day today. Hey, check this out. Check this cloud out there. Let me just put this down here and let me do that. Check that cloud in the sky. That looks cool, doesn't it? Kind of artistic. It's got a lot of flair. I'm going to put this back here and I'm going to put this back here. So you're really out of exposed. Um, yeah, it's, it's a cold day. I've had to bust out the Happy Canadian Toque for the first time. It's still autumn. It's not winter. Hey Siri, what's the temperature? It's currently 16 degrees. So 16 degrees is, you know, one of the colder days. It's not fully cold. Uh, if you are playing outside of Australia, you'd be giggling at me thinking that this is cold. This is inside the house and I'm still wearing a toque and a hoodie, but that's the way it is here in Australia. Now, do you remember a couple of weeks ago, the kids were down and we were playing a game where we were hunting, what did we call it? Find, it's called Find the Rock. I would throw a rock into the water and the kids, Baxter and Claudia, would go swimming to pick it up to try to find it. And the rock that we were throwing was a rock that Baxter had found. Well, we brought that rock home and we've had it sitting in, in the house here for the last two weeks. By the way, Check that video up there where we actually played the game. But what I want to do is, I want to ask you if you think The Rock could be a bomb. That is The Rock. Now, the reason I'm asking you if you think it could be a bomb, or what are they, what's the term? An or ordinance? An or an unexploded ordinance. Because of the shape of it, it's a very cylindrical rock slash bomb. Uh, and it has an unusual, let me put it on the ground, up against the door. It has an unusual little divot there. That little divot thing is a little, little unusual. It's, I mean, it's heavy enough to be a bomb. It's round enough to be a bomb. Now you might be you might be thinking, dude, what the hell? You've got a, you've got a circular rock. Why would you think it's a bomb? The reason, hey, if it's a bomb, I probably shouldn't be throwing it around like this. We the reason that this has come to light that this may be an unexploded ordnance is that it was found at the Beecroft Weapons Range, which is a a massive stretch of land not far from where we are right now, which is used by the Navy, the Australian Navy or the Air Force, one or the other. And it's where they literally test weapons. Um, obviously it's closed to the public on those days, but when they're not testing weapons there, the whole place is public access because it's, it's on Jarvis Bay. It's a beautiful set of coastline with beaches and great picnic spots and, you know, camping areas and stuff. But there are signs everywhere saying, you know, do not enter this area, uh, risk of laser beams and risks of unexploded ordnance. And so we found this there. And I'm kind of thinking, should we get this out of the house if this is an unexploded ordnance? Uh, should this... I mean, there's... what's that as well? Should we remove this from, from, from the house uh, in fear that it may explode? Or am I just completely whacked? Uh, it sounds like a rock when you tap it. I was going to tap it against my head, but you're not going to hear Jack. And I don't have anything to tap it against here, but 